Number one spokesman of uh, Nigeria. You're welcome. His Excellency, the Deputy Governor of Bayasa State. And I'd like to observe your protocol and welcome your team from Abuja. The edifice behind us here is... Okay, my name is Mike Obolosinga. <laughs> the Mayor of Yenegua. You are in the Secretariat of uh, the City Council. And the edifice behind you is a two-story Secretariat Annex. It has about 57 office spaces. It has a uh, As a hall for the legislation, the, like the, the lawmakers, a particular wing is dedicated for the legislative assembly, their office spaces, and uh, their chamber. And then the order is to accommodate our staff. Infrastructure has been our major challenge, and uh, within this period, we were able to come up with this. And uh, we're waiting for His Excellency the Governor to formally commission it in the occasion of his uh, tour of local governments in the states. Okay, the cost is about a hundred and seventy million. It took us about um, two years to embark on these projects. A question about this uh, project. Any question or comment from stakeholders? Any question, please, or comment? Yeah, come. One, two, please. I'm um, sorry, Mohammed Kabir, Media Insight. Is this a local government project or is this a state project? Local government project? Yes, answered. Any other question, please? Minister. Well, uh, this is uh, Yenagua Local Government uh, Council Secretariat, built by the local government, which is on funds. 170 million, million naira, uh, part direct label, part contract. This is what the chairman explained to us. And uh, we have gone in to verify the quality of work. And I am satisfied that this is a very good project. And I also want to commend the local government uh, for building this uh, edifice here. And uh, at a very reasonable cost. I think this is very, very good. Uh, if other local governments do this all across, then they will have the infrastructure for development. And because uh, we may not be coming back to you soon, we also hope that you are doing something for your primary schools, because primary schools are under the authority of local government councils, and also local markets, uh, which should be built uh, for local communities, uh, and where also government can, local government can also derive its own revenue. So we want to see functional local governments that are performing and are also developing the grassroots. This is good. And like I said, this National Good Governance Tour is to inspect the projects of state, federal, and local governments. It is not everywhere we have gone that we have seen projects by local governments. So we are very happy that here, at the Yenegua Municipal Council, uh, the mayor has done a very good project, and the National Good Governance Tour is very happy with this project. Thank you, yes.